Located in the heart of East Oakland, the Oakland Barber Academy offers a unique blend of education and practice. This vocational school trains individuals to become licensed barbers in California, and they're making a big impact in the community. Here to tell us more is the owner of Oakland Barber Academy, Chris Coulter, and student, UCAL Kennard. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thanks for having us, Jess. Yeah, so tell me all about Oakland Barber Academy. So, Oakland Barber Academy was an idea I had about ooh, 10 years ago. And since then, it's been a long journey in terms of paperwork. I was able to uh, complete all the paperwork to get certified by the state of California. And uh, yeah, we finally opened our doors. And why is it so important for barbers to get licensed? Uh, first and foremost, it's public health and public safety. Uh, we deal with a lot of razors. We deal with chemicals. And... Um, it's important that we practice sanitation practices so that we can protect the uh, also beloved citizens of California. Yeah, and you, Cal, you are a student. Um, what has this program been like for you going through? Oh, it was a godsend. Um, this was, Barbara has always been a passion of mine, and um, cutting hair was just something that was just in me. Started with family, family to friends, and it, I was started off in my driveway for the longest, and then Somehow or another, I fell into the hands of Chris. Chris got me through the program, graduated, and now I'm also a, not only a graduate, but I'm a, I'm a head instructor. He's our head instructor. Okay, head instructor. I apologize. <laughs> you were a student. You graduated. Right. Yeah, and head And he instructor. successfully completed the state board examination on the first try. Uh, congratulations on that as well. Thank you. Well, Chris, how else is the um, Barber Academy impacting the community? Uh, for years in the city of Oakland, there was uh, one show in town. It was a big established barber college in North Oakland, and you had this big gap between North Oakland and San Leandro, right there in East Oakland, which is where, where I'm located. So yeah, if you, uh, if you lived in East Oakland, you'd have to travel uh, about 10 miles, but now we, uh, we, uh, that was a fertile area and we filled that gap. And uh, so yeah, if you're in East Oakland, you have an opportunity to be a barber right there on 55th and Telegraph. Amazing. Okay, well, you guys are going to walk us through some of the different looks and styles because, of course, when it comes to, you know, getting the fresh haircut, it's all about, you know, <laughs> having that sweet look. So let's bring up our first picture, and you can uh, walk me through what we're looking at, Chris. Okay, this is a, a classic taper, right? And I believe he has uh, some dreadlocks on the top with the uh, hard line in the front. A uh, taper, that's a specific haircut. And uh, when you say taper here in California, that simply means you get a mini taper on your temples and you taper out the back as well. Uh, and this is something that you're teaching your students, right? Absolutely. Okay. And these are pretty standard haircuts in the uh, inner cities throughout America for that fact. Okay, UCAL, I'll have you describe our next one. Let's bring up our next photo. And UCAL, you can tell me about this look. All right, this one is also a taper, but to be more specific, this is a high taper. Um, as you notice from the picture before, this one here doesn't have the C cup. Mm -hmm. And so um, it's more blown out on the sides. And uh, yeah, that's what you got there, high taper um, with this on the sides and the back. About how long would you say it takes to do this cut? Uh, for a service like this, anywhere between 30 to 40, 45 minutes. Okay, amazing. All right, let's bring in, I think we have another photo to look at. Let's look at this next look. And Chris, tell me about this one. Okay, now this is a fade haircut, specifically a bald fade haircut. And the hair level on top, I would say, is about a one and a half. And you, uh, and that's going with the grain, which simply means you move the, the clipper in the direction that the hair grows. And in this case, it's going towards the, fore, uh, the forehead. Uh, he's got some enhancements going on, uh, which is some black spray to really accent the, the hairline in the front and the, in the corner of the hairline. All right, and I think we have one more look. Let's bring up this next look, and I'll have you, Cal, describe this one. Okay, this one is also a fade. Um, more, more specific is more of a, a, a skin-tight fade, closer to the skin. Um, this one also has enhancements as well, um, just to accent the, the outer, outer perimeter and the, the corners of the, the haircut. Okay, amazing. Well, I love these looks, and you guys also brought one a model here. So let's head on and over. And student. And student. Let's <laughs> head on over there to kind of uh, walk me through this look and kind of what your students are learning um, when you guys are teaching them at the barber school. 
Okay, this is Angel. He's a student. He's about 100 uh, hours away from graduating. He's also wearing this high taper. Uh, like I said, you got mini fades right here on the corner, and we taper out the back, and usually you blend right into the fade. And in Angel's case, with this uh, straight hair, we do some light scissor work on the top. And about how long would this look take, you count? Uh, approximately 40 minutes. Okay, yeah. that's a long time, yeah. So take me through a little bit of the program and kind of what students, um, how long is it, and then what you hope students achieve when they get their certificate and leave you guys. Okay, uh, the barbering program is a thousand hour program which equates to about seven months if you come to class and taking care of your business. <laughs> uh, uh, on average, it could take about a year as well, but yeah, seven to eight months. Um, and once you've accumulated 1,000 hours or you get close to 1,000 hours, we go ahead and get you a test date so you can uh, take the tests and obtain your um, state licensure with the uh, State Board of California. UCAL, what has this experience meant to you to start as a student and now be one of the head teachers at the school? Um, one word comes to, come to my mind is family. I have a family of my own, so um, this has been a great opportunity to help support um, those that I love. Amazing. And for, for anyone that is looking to get their license and enroll, um, what is the information that they would need to do so? Uh, simply go to oakbarberac.com. All the information is on there. Uh, and might I add, we are not accredited, which means we do not have a financial aid program, but the plot price is very, very, very uh, attainable. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for being here to show off your looks with us today. Really appreciate it.